So now we're going to be preparing our lines for our new mobile face. What we happen to have the instrument in is actually the same exact mobile face. So technically this isn't really as important, although we're going to cover everything just as if it is. So what we want to do is first, I'm tall so I can access everything from up top here. Most people won't. And for safety, let's have everything working at that at a, a comfortable level. We have our NFPA label, so we know what's in here, who made it, and how hazard, how hazardous it is. That's important for EHS, it's important for anybody else who might be in the lab working with you. So remember, if you're gonna be using, let's say we only wanna use this one component, and we wanna pull 100% of it through line A. We have four lines, A, B, C, and D. We can't just put line A in here and expect no issues there will be back pressure and there will be suction on lines B, C, and D. And assuming this might be in a totally different mobile phase, that is an issue, and you don't want that issue to, to hurt your analysis. This line right here is our needle wash. So this is actually something that's pulled straight from our mobile phase. And what that will do is wash our needle in between injections, and we will manually wash before we even start. So make sure this is in. If you look at the bottle, one thing you got to look out for is if you add too much line in, look what happens. It's going to start curling up. So if you try and add too much line, that inlet is now at 700 mLs. So you actually only have 200 mLs in this bottle for that line. So you want to make sure that your lines are sitting on the bottom. So that way they're going to pull all available volume. And in addition to that, we're going to one by one change our four lines. And in between changing, if you were to move this with some different solution directly into this mobile phase bottle, every time you do that, you're introducing impurity. So we're going to go prepare a beaker of 100% organic because we have organic in water. So whatever our organic is, we're going to use that to rinse our inlet filters. These are fiberglass filters, and we're going to wash those glass fiberglass filters with our pure acetonitrile before we introduce it to our new mobile phase bottle.